Hi everyone, today we are going to be making the famous Cosmopolitan or Cosmo. Very simple ingredient list, very simple instructions, so we're going to walk through this together. So you're going to start off with vodka. I prefer Tito's, but you can go any way you want. You're going to want triple sec, which is an orange flavored liqueur, and then some lime juice here, some cranberry juice to, to flavor, and then a lime wedge to garnish. Very simple equipment list as well. You want a martini glass and then any sort of cocktail shaker that you have. Okay, we're gonna start off by taking the, the vodka. It's about two and a half ounces. If you're doing this with a speed pour, it's about a five count. If you count slow, if you count fast, it's still gonna be about two to two and a half ounces, depending on how strong you want your martini. Okay, then you wanna go about half an ounce to an ounce of triple sec. Splash a lime juice in there just to give it a little bit of a nice acidity. And then you're gonna want some cranberry juice as well. The cranberry juice is really to your taste and to which hue you want the drink to be. Once it's all in your cocktail shaker, you're gonna take that, make sure it's on nice and tight so it doesn't go flying all over the kitchen. You're gonna to wanna to shake that up. Now the more you shake your cocktail, the more diluted with ice it's gonna be. So if you don't really want it that diluted, you can even really just kind of stir it around in the, in the cocktail shaker. If you really kind of like it on the lighter side, shake it pretty hard, okay? Then you're gonna pour that right into the glass. Garnish with a lime, and you are good to go, your traditional cosmopolitan. Some fun twists on this. If you wanted to make this a bit of a purple hue, the purple cosmopolitan is actually one of my favorite drinks to kind of throw out there at random. Instead of triple sec, you're gonna use blue curacao, which is still an orange liqueur, but instead of this nice pink hue, it gives it a beautiful purple hue, and it's just kind of a fun cocktail when you wanna keep the drink the same, but change up the atmosphere a little bit. Cheers.